they dug their own grave trying to bring you down look at these people so clueless look at what they're doing in an attempt to destroy you they are destroying themselves look at them digging a grave thinking that the grave is for you but it is for themselves see them engaging in self sabotage they're coming at you full force trying to end your career to destroy you to bring you down to turn everybody against you how crazy could they be see them embarrassing themselves in the process see them making a fool out of themselves they don't want to wait their turn they want it now and they think that they could possibly steal it from you they are working against you so they think on one hand they are all of the terrible things they are saying about you evil wicked they want to end it for you but if they were smarter if they were wiser they wouldn't have been doing what they are doing they are working against you on one hand but really and truly they are working against themselves you have what you have your blessing is your blessing and nobody can take it away from you nobody can take away your talent from you it is your gift and you've been nurturing it you have that winner's mindset that advancing mindset and you've been taking inspired action based on that mindset you are a winner a go-getter you've been winning you've been through so much you've been through the pain through the obstacles yet still you rise they tried to bury you they didn't know you were a seed and you're rising up and up and up no weapon formed against you can ever prosper your haters your enemies once upon a time they acted as if they were so cool with you they acted as if you meant so much to them there they were trying to associate with you and your light you and your blessings you and your talent you and your beauty you and your glory there they were trying to associate with that making everybody think that they are a part of what you are a part of what you belong to that they are in the same position as you or you are so close to them hmm? there they were pretending to be on the side of light there they were pretending to be on the winning side there they were saying so many favorable things about you good things about you they wanted to become or get close to you they wanted something from you they wanted to take what's yours you didn't let them have their way with you and that got them so mad that got them so angry you who had given so much to them before there came a time when you couldn't have given any more because of who these people are you saw through them you realize hey I don't want to associate with this person again 
anymore. You distance yourself from them and rightfully so. That got them so angry. That got them so mad. They wanted to take a revenge against you. You weren't really doing anything bad to them. You just had to cut them off because they deserve to be cut off. You shouldn't have been walking with them in the first place. Thankfully, you learned lessons. Walking with them was like a big mistake, but you learned lessons, thankfully. You see, every disappointment is a blessing. In, in, the, in the bad, there's good as well. You could take good from it. You could take the negative and make something positive with it <laughs> as you give the video a thumbs up smash that like button everybody click like for the youtube algorithm hmm? so they got mad at you they got angry because they were not getting what they want from you these people these people want to control you they think it's their way like somebody said, their way or the highway, they think it's their way or no other way. They've been wanting to control you. Who are they to ever think they can control you? You did so much for them. Very often you are the one who gave them that break. You are the one who helped them on their journey. Hmm? They wanted to outshine you. They started to bite the hand that feeds them. The same hand that feeds them is the same hand they're biting. The same roof that covered them. They will still say you left them outside to get wet. This artist wrote a song about that and I love it very much praying man hmm? they started to bite the hand that feeds them would you believe it and now they don't have a chance now there is no redemption for them so to speak now it's the end for them they've gone too far they said too much they've attacked you in every way They've gone overboard in an attempt to get what they want from you, in an attempt to control you, acting as if they own you, acting so entitled. So there they were, doing you wrong, offending you, and they did offend the wrong person. Down. That is the end. That is the end thinking that they are digging a grave for you but it was for themselves now they lost that opportunity with you and even more than that they lost an opportunity with people who are advancing like you are who are on the side of light like you are Everybody is looking at them, the evil people that they are. Everybody is seeing through them. They have exposed themselves. What they did in the dark is coming to light, has come to light. They have showed everybody their true colors and that is it for them. When they try to destroy you, they don't realize that they are only destroying themselves. They were digging a grave, but the grave was inadvertently for themselves and they ruined their reputation in the process. Ruined their reputation. Nobody wants to associate with them anymore. Wow! That is what they're doing. That is what you're doing. They. That is what they're doing. After everything you did for them, they're attacking you. Nobody wants to be around them anymore. Nobody wants to associate with them anymore. They destroyed themselves in an attempt to destroy the chosen one that you are. 
the advancing man or advancing woman that you are, the man who can or the woman who can. He that diggeth a pit shall fall in it. Whosoever digs a pit will surely fall in it. Whosoever rolls a stone, the stone will roll over them. Whosoever sets a trap, thinking that the trap is for you watching me here on this YouTube channel, the trap is for themselves. If they were smart, if they were wise, they wouldn't have done what they did. And some of these people, advancing man, advancing woman, woman are you with me? <laughs> some of these people, jealousy is killing them. Envy is destroying them. They see your bright light shining. They see you rising. They see how the entire universe is conspiring in your favor. You are doing well. Instead of being inspired by you, Instead of saying, wow, how amazing, I want some of this too. Meanwhile, while acknowledging you, while being happy for you, they refuse to be happy for you. They won't be happy for you. They're jealous. And they are trying so hard to destroy you. Jealous. Talking bad about you. They don't know how to read the room. The entire room got mad at them and started throwing toilet paper after them. Toilet paper, <laughs> figuratively speaking, because they are full of. They started to attack you. They started, they started to attack the chosen one. They thought that by bringing you down, they would have been lifted up. They said terrible things about you. Wrong timing. Mm -mm. They started to attack you. Big mistake. And everybody just turned their backs on them, rightfully so. They went too far. All because of jealousy. People found out for once and for all who these people are. You see, a lot of people were in doubt. Is she really like that? Is he really like that? Maybe we misinterpreted. Maybe we're judging her wrong, him wrong. Maybe we just didn't understand. Let's give her the benefit of the doubt. Let's give him the benefit of the doubt. Somebody can be so mean, so evil, so wicked. No. But you see, time exposes everything. So as time went by, they couldn't help it. They couldn't control themselves. They couldn't control themselves. They kept talking, and the more they talked, the more people saw through them. The way they talked. The energy. Because, you know, it's one thing to talk, but how about the energy behind it? As a spiritual person, you're not only listening to the words, but the energy behind the words. It's not just the words. Mm -hmm. And really and truly, they were just showing everybody who they are. It was never about you. The things they say about you says more about them than they say, than they do about you. More about themselves than you. It has nothing to do with you. A lot of the time these people are just projecting. What they're saying about you is really none of your business. It is their business. Let them talk. Let them keep showing you who they are. So people saw through them. They exposed themselves. And that is it for them. It was only a matter of time. That is it. That is it for them and their darkness. 
They want what you have. They want your gifts. They want your talents. They want to be you. They want to be in your place. They want to win. But they think that the way to win is by destroying everybody. The way to have the biggest building is by destroying everybody's building. They want to destroy your building. But they end up destroying themselves in the process. They are not a match for greatness, for victory. Because they hate it when people are victorious. They hate it when people win. They are saying to the universe, hey, don't bring victory in my life. Don't bring success. Don't bring good things in my life. I am against this. You see how I hate when this sister, when this brother over there is winning. Don't bring me that in my life. <laughs> and when you ask, it is given. These people have a scarcity mindset as opposed to an abundance mindset. An orange, it has quote-unquote an abundance mindset. A fruit, just look at nature. <laughs> just look at nature. You can tell how many seeds are in an orange, right? Can't you? You can cut up an orange and you can tell how many seeds are in it. But you can never tell how many oranges are in a seed. Hmm. Limitless. We live in a limitless universe. An abundant universe. It's a universe of, ab of abundance. So, if you look at what's happening in nature, la nature teaches. Nature. You can look at nature, and that is all you need. You will learn from nature. Mm. So they have a scarcity mindset as opposed to an abundance mindset. You have not taken anything away from them. You are not the one keeping them back. Nobody can keep you back. Nobody. If there is no enemy within, the enemy without can do you no harm. That is their business. No weapon formed against you can ever prosper. No curse can ever work against you. No spell can ever work against you. Because you get to choose. You get to choose beautiful things. You know, sometimes we go off track. Pick yourself up. Dust yourself up and start all over again. We make mistakes. That is all right. You will learn from your mistakes but you know ultimately everything is always working out for you everything is fine the entire universe is conspiring in your favor you are fine all is well and you are fine all of what they're doing over there that is just noise they're just making a fool out of themselves embarrassing themselves that doesn't stop you from winning you are winning. You are getting what you want. You are manifesting your heart's desires. Ask and it is given. When you are a vibrational match for the thing you have asked for, you will get its physical equivalent. In other words, it will be in your hands. How about that? They were trying to destroy you, but they ended up destroying themselves. And what goes around comes around. As we hear on this advancing channel, I appreciate you. I appreciate you so much those of you who are members of this channel I appreciate you <laughs> we have a nice little crew nice membership and you too can become a member if you haven't become one as yet big shout out part of the books <laughs> big shout out to Antonikis Aurelius my brother you're amazing bro Big up to Jacqueline Hicks, my sister, you're amazing sis. And big up to every one of you watching me here on this advancing channel. You are valued and you are appreciated. Thank you for being a member, a subscriber. Advancing luminary, visionary and explorer. Thank you for your support of this channel. Via PayPal, via Super Thanks. Hmm? 
I appreciate you. Ursula, I appreciate you. Hey, and so many of you, so many of you. I may not mention your name, but I know who I am talking about. I see you in the comments, and that is you. Big up yourself. My name is Manchus. I am sending you loads of positive energy. Thank you so much for watching. One love. God bless. And all the... <laughs> and all the best. <laughs>